Welcome to this week's episode of the Fitness Coaches Corner. I'm Frank Nash. I'm Diane Hastings. Today we're going to talk a little bit different about nutrition and dieting to lose body fat. The thing about dieting and diets in general is they all work. They all work if you adhere to them. The diet we're going to talk about today is called the Velocity Diet. Now the traditional diets that Diane and I have given, we find really don't work because you just don't lose weight fast enough. You really don't create really any good habits and you really don't break any bad habits. Um, and more importantly, if you're on a diet, you don't want to lose a half a pound or a pound a week. You want to lose like four, five, six. And that's why we find these fast acting plans like the Velocity work so well, not just for short term success, but for long term habit breaking and forming. I'm still on the Velocity Diet in day 11. Um, in my first seven days, I lost six pounds. Diane, what is the Velocity Diet? Um, well, the original version of the Velocity Diet, the real Velocity Diet, is six protein shakes a day. That's it. That's it. That's it. Our version of the Velocity Diet is three shakes a day, plus a salad with a, some sort of protein. Now, Diane, you've done the Velocity Diet. I've done the Velocity Diet. Tell us a little bit about your experiences with that. Um, when I first did the Velocity Diet, um, maybe six months ago, I did my modified version of it. So <laughs> I allowed myself a few extras. I did lose weight. Um, I did hit my goal, but it took me uh, probably about three weeks. So I decided to try it again. This week I stuck to it, this time I stuck to it 100%, um, and I've lost as much weight in seven days as I did in three weeks, so. Did you lose strength? Absolutely not. Did you uh, lose body fat? Uh, yes. Yeah. How was your energy? Energy was okay. When you go through some dips, you know, you might feel a little tired sometimes, but overall, energy is fine. Diane. With the Velocity Diet, we talk a lot about nutrients and eating for nutrient value, not taste or comfort. Talk to me a little about, bit about habit forming and why habit forming is so important for long-term success. Um, within that 28 days, we find that that's, a, that's the amount of time it takes to really break the bad habits that have been created and to start creating some really good new habits. So, Diane, you've done the Velocity Diet. I've done the Velocity Diet. We have a boatload of members who have seen a lot of success on this plan. What would you say to a potential member or someone looking to do this plan who said, you know what, that's unhealthy. Um, losing that much weight that fast isn't good for you. What would your response be? It's not unhealthy. Depending on your goal, um, whether you're looking to lose you know, 100 pounds or 10 pounds, it's not unhealthy at all. You're creating good habits, uh, you're still working out, you're still strong, it's not unsafe or unhealthy. Is the Velocity Diet for everybody? I would definitely say yes, um, whether you're looking to lose five pounds or a hundred pounds. Um, if you want results fast and you want to lose body fat and get lean, then yes, it is for everybody. Who wouldn't want that? People who succeed on the Velocity Diet have a certain dialogue with us. Can you share with us some of the things that are said for people who are succeeding on this plan? They say, so hungry, I, I feel like I could eat my right arm off. Uh, this is so boring, I can't go out. Um, I was so hungry, I, I grabbed a pretzel the other day. I know I wasn't supposed to. In our experiences, on the flip side, people who fail at this plan, their dialogue is what? I'm not losing any weight. I've done this perfectly. I haven't cheated once. I'm not even hungry, but I haven't lost any weight. Over the years, I've given countless food plans and diets. I've talked to hundreds of people about the Velocity Diet and put them on it. And I know you have too. What do you find is the hardest part prescribing this plan to somebody who's looking to lose a lot of body fat? To get them to understand that they, they need to reprogram themselves to start eating for nutrients, high nutrient value as, a, as opposed to you know fast and easy or I, I want this, it's gonna taste good. Um, and just to start creating good habits. So Diane, we've given this plan out a lot. When we first initially talked to somebody about the Velocity Diet, the initial response is, oh, I can't do that. That's crazy. That's bonkers. 
What do you feel is the biggest misunderstanding or misconception about this plan is? I would say that when we talk to somebody about the Velocity Diet, most people react the same way, like, oh my God, I can't do that. It, it, that's it, that's all I can have. Um, that would be the biggest thing. I think they right off the bat think that, you know, there's no way I'm going to do this. It's not enough calories. And... We talk about nutritional planning a lot with members. If you're looking to lose a lot of body fat really fast, if you're looking to create really good habits and break bad habits, try the Velocity Diet. Consult your physician, of course, first. But in reality, you're eating low calorie, high nutrient, you're eating four nutrients, not pleasure or comfort. You'll lose a lot of weight really fast. That becomes comforting. Comforting foods take a back seat to your new skinny self. Try the Velocity Diet, lose a lot of weight really fast, and be happy. Again, this is Frank Nash and Diane Hastings. This is the Fitness Coaches Corner.